Hey guys, Hook Horse here and welcome back to another video. Now, today I'm going to be starting a new series on this channel. Um, I've recently got into Minecraft Pocket Edition. Now, why I got into the Pocket Edition, I don't know why. I think I just play more on my iPad because um, I don't really sit at a computer too much. I like playing like when I'm on the go and stuff. So, I decided, you know, loads of people do Minecraft videos and all that. But uh, I thought I'd do something a little bit different for you guys. So I'm going to play Minecraft Pocket Edition. Now as you can see from the title I'm saying Hardcore Mode. But as you can see here, there's no Hardcore Mode. It's only Survival and Creative. So what I'm going to be doing is, I'm going to be playing on Survival Mode. But whenever I die, that's it. It's like Hardcore Mode. If I die, that's it. The world's gone. Uh, whatever. You know what I mean? So if I die guys, it's over. So that's, that's how I'm going to play this um, hardcore mode. So I'm going to call the world. So I'm going to call the world uh, hook, hook, just hook. Keep it simple. Okay, I've, I'm not very creative when it comes to that sort of stuff thinking on the spot. But uh, yeah, so our, our, our world name is hook. And so yeah, let's just jump into it. I'm not going to do any uh, seeds or anything. I'm just going to let... Let the game decide who or where we spawn. Alright guys, so you can see here that, uh, yeah, we spawn like in a jungle. Now, I've done this before, like, without recording it, and my plan of action is, guys, when I'm playing, like, hardcore mode, because I think it's just more fun to play it that way, um, I like to build, like, a really secure house to start off with. So that way, like, I don't die. So one of my first objectives here is I'm going to try and get down without losing any hearts here. Alright, please don't lose any hearts. So I need to find a sheep. Because I don't want to... Like, if I stay awake during the night, not only am I going to lose hunger bars, but I have more chance of dying in the night. So I want to try and find a sheep. Now, I don't know if they spawn a lot here. Um, I'm going to build a sword real quick as well so that I can actually kill the sheep a lot quicker. So let's build a crafting bench and some sticks. Alright, let's lay that down there. Alright, I'm just going to have a wooden sword for now. I know I shouldn't be doing this with the sword, but you know what? I might as well. So let's go on the hunt for sheep if I can get out of there. Alright guys, so... I'm gonna, like, the first night, I'm probably just gonna, oh, that's a chicken. Um, I'm probably just gonna skip over the first night. What I do, like, I am a bit of a, a coward when it comes to the first night here. I just, like, bury myself in the ground. Now, the thing about that is, oh, is that it? Oh, my God, sheep. Oh, my God. Yes, two of them. Oh, one's a baby. Am I gonna get anything from the baby? Kill the baby. I wonder if, like, Minecraft will add an update where animals fight back. Did I seriously? Oh my god, I actually got one. Alright. Where there is sheep and babies, there must be more sheep. It's my argument. Now, a lot of you guys probably don't play Pocket Edition, and I think it's going to be a mo bit more interesting because they have different stuff on uh, Pocket Edition, and they're missing out on a lot of stuff as well. So, it might be like kind of a throwback to a, to a bit of like old Minecraft for a lot of you guys. Um, and if you if you guys to play Pocket Edition more than like the normal Minecraft, then... Uh, then it might be fun for you guys too. I oh my god, I'm way too high up here. I'm not gonna find sheep up here. What am I doing? Hmm, what's my plan of action? I'm just gonna go into the forest and see if I can find some sheep there. I really don't wanna have to stay awake the first night because it'll be so boring. Um and also like sometimes when you, you think you're safe and you've buried yourself into a, a cave or anything. And then you come outside and a creeper's just waiting outside, like around the corner for you, and you just die instantly, and there you go, that's game over, because you're playing on hardcore mode. So, I really don't want that to happen, I want to sleep through the first night and actually be able then to build a very secure base. Hmm. So I'm going to be making, guys, this is like a feeler, so if this does well, then I'll continue this series, if it doesn't, then I might continue it anyway, because I like it, but, um, yeah. Let's see if we can, oh my god, come on, where are the... 
Where are the sheep here? Oh, wolves. I'm not going to find sheep around wolves, guys. For all of you guys that play Minecraft, you know that if there's sheep and wolves together, it's not going to end well for the sheeps. Sheeps, sheep. Just sheep. That was very bad grammar there. Um, yeah. Let's see. Ah, uh, God, I really don't want to mess with the wolves. I want to try and stay as far away as the wolves as possible. Hmm. Come on, sheep. Come on. Where are you? Hopefully the wolves haven't done it. Um, yeah, I'm dying. So, oh, there's another thing. Just as I was going to say, having a food source. Oh, here we go. Having a food source as well when you're playing on hardcore mode. First of all, you need to set up a secure base, which is probably going to come in the next episode if I don't find um, sheep to sleep through the night. Oh, yes, sheep. It doesn't matter as well what color uh, wool you get. As long as you have three pieces of wool, you can make a bed. Give me two. Give me two. Oh, no. How many did I get from him? Please tell me you gave me two. Oh, no. He only gave me one. Okay. So, I've got food here. Oh, my God. Is that a donkey? A horse. Oh, we found another sheep. We're going to have a bed for the night. All right, guys. So... I'm trying to cut these episodes down a bit just because um, I'm, I'm just I'm just playing around with uh, the style and stuff so we have got our bed for the night so what I am going to do here is I am going to build probably like a really bad base I also want to kill these cows because uh, another thing if you're playing a hardcore another tip I can give you is having see I can get now I have four pieces of leather getting armor as quickly as possible even though it's leather and leather really really is bad on this game it's still better than nothing i'd rather have leather armor if a creeper blows up behind me or something attacks me than having no armor so i try to kill as many cows and stuff as possible now i have no idea where i'm going to build my base i usually build it on the water um and i'll tell you why because when you build it on the water you can also create a moat which is really cool Building it on an island is your probably your best, like just off the coast, building it off an island is your best um, shot at surviving. Now, you may be asking yourself, well, what's the goal of this, you know, Hook? What's the goal of... Oh, God, he was glitching out there. Another one's glitching out. I'm going to free you by killing you. Um, what is the point of playing uh, hardcore? Well, you want to get as far as you can in the game without dying. Uh, that's basically it. It's it's a lot more fun because you play the game differently. You know when you play the game. Oh my god, what was that? What was that? Oh my god, Archer, we're not gonna go after you just yet because I really don't want to die in the first episode. So uh, yeah, let's keep going here. Where? Oh, that that flat area over there looks like a good place to start my first base. I'm not gonna kill you, chicken. You can survive. So I think I might start building my base over here. Probably build it into this little mountain if you can see where I'm facing now for the first night. And why did that just... What happened there? Did you guys see that? Did you guys see that just explode, that rose bush? <laughs> that was weird. That was... Maybe I've got like a ghost in the game. Oh, maybe. <laughs> yeah, okay. So I think I'm going to build it into this mountain here because now... It's it's underwater, so I have a better chance here. So I'm gonna be a bit of a coward for the first night, just to be safe. And then when I wake up in the morning, I'm gonna cut out the night time. The next day, guys, is going to be the next episode. I'm going to try and keep this like I'm not gonna try and keep it one day at a time, but I'm gonna try and cut it down for you guys, so I can give you guys the most action in one day. If you want to see it like completely unedited, guys, as well. Just leave a comment below or you can talk to me on Twitter anytime. So let's just throw down the crafting table. And we are going to have to have a wooden pickaxe. Now we can start. I also need to get some. Do I need, do I need them? No, I don't think so. So another thing I like to do as well, and I don't know why, is whenever I build into a cave and I sleep there for the night, I always build like an L, or like um, 
like a 90 degree kind of angle thing towards either the left or the right. I don't know why I don't like sleeping just like that. So we are also going to build a door. This isn't where we're going to live guys, don't worry about that. Oh, a spruce door. That's nice. Spruce doors are nice, I'm going to take that with me from my house. And I made three of them. Do you just make three automatically? I swear on my last game I made three as well. Hmm. Well, let's make sure we build this bed. This is the most important thing. We've got the bed. Now, I can throw the bed in here. So, I want to also build an axe. Oh, we'll build a stone sword. Hmm, do we have... Oh, God, I'm going to drown. That would be really, really, uh... <laughs> wouldn't be the, the coolest thing to drown is your first death by accident on your hardcore survival mode. I'm hoping to keep this going for a long time. On uh, other, like, non-recording sessions I had, I made it last, like, a really, really long time, so... I really, uh, I really enjoyed watching, like, I used to... I used to really enjoy watching, like, um... Like, kind of, like, challenge Minecraft videos, if you know what I mean? Like, um, do you remember, guys, when Skyblock was out and people made Skyblock? And that, that was so much fun to watch. I can't remember who was the big YouTuber who did that. But, like, I really enjoyed watching them. Um, it was so much fun. And then I think um, Syndicate did a, a survival series and it was a lot of fun as well. So, oh god, the, the uh, sun is going down guys. So I'm going to go into my little cave here. I really should bring that crafting table in here. But, you know what, we've got a bed and I'll be out here in the morning. Hopefully no creepers sneak up on me. So, yeah, let's see if we can go to bed now. Probably not. Oh, we can. Okay, deadly. That is perfect. That is fine. That is perfect. Alright, so it's the morning, guys. Hopefully no creepers or anything have spawned. Doesn't seem like it. I am going to turn quickly. No, we're good. We went to bed just in time. That is very, very nice. And, oh my goodness, I need to, uh, how far can I build this? I want to build a bridge going across here. Because... Probably this whole day, this whole next day, guys, I might end the episode around here. This whole next day, I'm going to be building the start of our first base. Now, I want to build, like, I like building, like, big, like, communities, like, loads of, um, like, little houses and, like, uh, different houses for different things. And also, like, the potential of building into, the like, the mountain and having, like, uh... Like a little mountain uh, house as well. Like not only, you know, that's not going to be our primary house because it'll be quite boring. But uh, if you guys have any suggestions on types of houses, and I'm building this so badly here. I don't know what I was doing here. So this is just going to make it a tiny bit easier. Let's keep the door closed. Now, now the first house as well, I'm just going to warn you, um, it's going to be quite ugly. So, yeah. It's going to be an ugly house, but uh, it's going to be somewhere to sleep and store our stuff. So then we can go out and adventures, try and find villages, try and get stuff. That's another thing, guys. I really like and I really enjoy finding villages in this game. And, uh, and uh, you know, kind of raiding them and then making them livable. I think the bad thing about this, and I wish Minecraft would update this. Um, and if you're with me on this, uh, say so in the comments. Is that all villages are the exact same. I mean, like... You know, you find different stuff in different villages, and sometimes they're laid out a tiny bit differently. But I wish there was, like, you know, and also there's, like, you know, the the desert village and the snow village, I don't, I think you call it. Um, they're different, but I wish, like, you could find, like, a proper town. Like, all, like a load of uh, villages would be different, and, uh, yeah, just kind of like that, you know, it'd be really interesting. Um, I think that's a, a really simple update Minecraft could probably make. Or like a lost village, guys. That would be that would be so cool. Like if there was villages under the water, like lost little villages that were like maybe swept under the water, something cool like that. Where there was no villagers or anything living in them, but like the the houses and things like that were uh, were still under the water. So I'm gonna end it here, guys. So the next episode, I'm probably I'm gonna probably collect all this wood off camera, not to bore you guys, and then I'm gonna begin building our house. So guys, if you have any suggestions on what type of house it is, I know what kind of house I want. I like making kind of all the walls glass so I can look outside and doing something like that. It's going to be a very simple, small house for our first house. But uh, yeah, if you enjoyed this, guys, and you want to see more, 
uh, just leave a comment below or like this video if you enjoyed it. And also, guys, if you never want to miss a video, all you have to do is hit that subscribe button. I'd love to have you part of the Hook Horse family. And besides that, guys, I will see you next time. See ya. Mm -hmm.